Dr. Nyanzi was not happy that she was not notified that she would not physically appear in court for sentencing. A day earlier, Grade 1 magistrate at Buganda Road Court, Gladys Kamasanyu, had found her guilty of cyber harassment against President Museveni. She was sentenced to 18 months in prison. She stands the balance of the period, which is a period of nine months. The prison services say Nyanzi's actions in court are against the law, and the spokesperson, Frank Baina, says new charges are lined up against her. According to the prison regulations of 2012, uh, he, she is going to be put under order room proceedings and if she's found guilty by the adjudicating officer, yeah, she's be, she will be penalized according to our system. According to Baine, the new charges will prevent similar conduct by other offenders. The community we are dealing with is a community of deviance and if you don't institute strict discipline and follow what we call you adhere to strict discipline requirements, then you risk sending the entire prison, prison system into chaos. Baine also responded to Nyanzi's request to the court to order the prison's administration to improve inmates' welfare. Rosera Women Prison is one of the cleanest prisons with standard hygiene, at least above, where and above, the minimum uh, required conditions of keeping offenders. Uh, but of course, maybe being that she's a, a woman of her class, a prison may not be as good as a hotel or as her home, but it meets the minimum required standards. And as far as she's a prisoner, she will have to be subjected to the conditions.